Ethereum is ready to make a massive move and if that sounds interesting to you, make sure to continue watching this video. Before we get started in today's video, I just want to give you guys a quick update in terms of our Telegram chat. I have been posting chart updates in real time. So for those of you that are interested in keeping up real time with me, make sure to check out the link in the bio and, and hope you guys enjoy the video. Hey guys, Pingu Church here. Welcome back to another Ethereum analysis video. As always, if you do enjoy my content, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. If you guys are interested in free $600 Bitcoin, make sure to check out the link in the bio. As you guys can see on Ethereum, we are testing a very crucial support level here at the 1180 mark. I have talked about this level many, many times. The reason why this level, of course, is important, as you can see from previous price analysis, we have tested this level multiple times before we finally saw that breakdown formation. This is the last support level the bulls really have in terms of control before we go and retest our major support here at one thousand dollars now there is a few things we want to talk about in this video number one of course is being the fact that we are seeing a nice midterm support being created on the four hour time frames you guys already know that when we tend to see this nice formation we do see a continuation but of course we can expect that move to the upside in terms of a liquidity grab it is monday morning but volume is extremely low for monday mornings usually we tend to see the moves that happen so i wouldn't be surprised if we do get a nice fake out continuation and then the move to the downside as of right now though from a bullish perspective if we did see a bullish move set we would have to try to break above this crucial resistance here at 1331 i know a lot of people are over leveraged in terms of their shorting position so i wouldn't be surprised if we did see a nice wick opportunity a ton of people are bearish right now on ethereum and as of right now we are still in this consolidation zone so we have to be very very careful any clean break above this 1331 and finding it as support would mean the fact that this is an inverse bar formation and we could be looking for a possible retest around here at 1518. Ideally from a bearish case scenario any break below this 1180 mark would mean the fact that we will be testing the second midterm support here at 1080 but as you guys already know that would become the third test opportunity. Right now, we are seeing multiple retests of these exponential moving averages. So we have to be very, very careful here. But we can't obviously look for that long position just yet based solely off the oversold RSI. What we're looking for in terms of a long position is a clean break to the upside in terms of exponential moving averages, finding them as support and then a continuation. As of right now, we are not seeing that volume come in on Ethereum. If I were to zoom in on the chart here, you can see we have multiple retests below the exponential moving averages and seeing them as a form of resistance. On the hourly time frame, you can see we are pretty much in a neutral standpoint there is no clean break above this level as well and we are starting to see low volume usually when we tend to see this low volume we do have an explosive move the question is going to be whether or not we will continue pushing on higher or of course a massive move to the downside as of right now there are a few things to note on the hourly time frames number one we have completed this move set in terms of a double bottom formation as well as the fact that we are now retesting this level a lot more than what we did previously you can see previously we actually saw five wicks to the downside and then a strong bullish move set as of right now we actually have over 10 candlesticks on the hourly time frames trying to break above these emas and failing this simply put wouldn't mean the fact that we are accumulating at this zone before we continue pushing on lower because looking at the rsi even on the hourly we are not in oversold condition so there is still quite a bit of moves to go from a bullish case scenario once again though we would have to try to break above this crucial resistance here at 1278 even on the hourly you can see we fail to break above that level multiple times so this would become technically speaking a third test opportunity if we were to get above there in my opinion though ethereum is extremely bearish but we just have to wait for that liquidity grab before we continue pushing on lower that's pretty much all i have for you guys today as always if you do enjoy my content make sure to hit the like and subscribe button if you guys are interested in free 600 bitcoin make sure to check out the link in the bio and thank you guys so much and have a wonderful day